All right, and I am back from London. It's been one week, one week and a couple of days, and it's just been one of the most awesome trips ever. We saw so much, did so much, got the experience so much. It was more than you could have physically imagined it being, and it was just great to be able to go over there with all those people who I had literally never met. I knew one person going into this, and now I talked to pretty much everyone in the group. I think I talked to everyone at least a few times every other day. And so I've made a lot of new friends, made a lot of awesome memories I'm always going to have with me. And it's just been really a great spring break to go and do this. Overall, I mean, I said I was excited for everything and definitely everything lived up to expectations. And then some, I was really looking forward to getting around all to those different games. And all the games were unique and a little bit different just because how the grounds were set up or where we were sitting. And it was super cool to get to experience all the different plays in the different leagues, how the different leagues were going to influence us and those sorts of things. And then I was a little nervous about being there on my own and what it was going to be like getting around and really finding my place and making sure I was there at our meetings on time and I really struggled to say the least at the start getting through customs was a bit of a struggle as my passport didn't want to scan and then I got on the wrong tube and I was going the opposite direction and then I took the right one going the right direction and got off too early and then I got on one going the wrong direction again and then I finally was on the right one but I started at the very end of the line and our Liverpool Street station stop was one of the last five so I got to ride the tube for a long while on that day I got back and then we had a few instances where the tubes weren't working with us so getting around was not always perfect but we found a way and I was never late for a meeting. Proud to say that, at least. The thing that I hoped to had learned more about was just, like, being a better fan coming back here. And one of the things I'm really going to embrace is just, like, getting ready for the match day and, like, looking forward to it because it is a big deal. And it's not just, like, oh, we play here this time with the, the, this opponent. Like, it's more of an experience getting to go out than it is here. It's not just another game to them. It's got more on the line, especially because of the relegation and promotion battles within the season. And then just getting to see all of your mates again and going together. Like the people in front of us at the QPR game had their names on the seats because they've been season ticket holders in those exact seats. I think they said at least 10 years. And so just being a better fan and not so much a commercialized fan, being more of a true fan like how they are over there is just one of those things I'm going to really try and be a bit better at. The program overall like just really opened up my eyes to how awesome this field of study is and just everything I'd look forward to about my future work is just I can't wait to get started. I was one of the youngest people on the trip. And now I have all the next three years to hold this trip with me and reflect on in all the decisions I make going forward about where I want to go. And then it gave me a lot of experience into working overseas and like seeing what some of the lower league people got to do overseas. The one guy who gave us our tour at Leyden, he was in his mid-20s and he'd been working there since he was like six or since he had been volunteering there since he was six. And he had like five different job titles and he was a part of the match day stuff he was doing tour guides he was a part of the staff he was a part of the stewardess crew and it's just a lot i'm sure for him but i'm i know for sure he loved it and so i'm just so excited to get started and move forward going through this path that i'm gonna be on because this trip has just been one of the best things that's happened so far. Some of the things I learned about British sport culture is obviously what I was saying before, how it's not just a match. It's more of like a getting together, and really embracing the match day itself. And then I learned a lot more about like these events to them are more of the social events you get. It's not solely focused on the sport, but the sport's there and it's a great thing to focus on, but it's more or less we're here to enjoy our our day out for the next 90 minutes and stoppage time and half time and all that and just really be together have a little bit of fun and watch watch some good football seeing as it was a more social event than it was just like an actual game it made it a lot different because going into it i figured everyone was going to be 
real dedicated, like, hardcore, hard nose. You sit in your seat, you do this, you do that, you know the chance. But it just seemed more like an open, everyone wants to be friends with everyone around them and get to know them a little bit and then just enjoy the game that's going on in front of them because you only get so much time to go out when you start doing your work weeks and it's the best excuse to go out and have a drink or two and then just get to watch your favorite team play some hopefully good football and hopefully get some good wins along the way. Obviously now since the trip concluded there is going to be a bit more of a video coming up here at the end that I will link later on down below. But overall, honestly, great trip, great experience. I wouldn't trade it for the world and I recommend anyone who's interested in the program to do it without a doubt. And yeah, honestly, I just I just had a blast and really looking forward to hopefully getting to experience something like that again in the future.